Hey guys, I'm here again to troubleshoot VMware Workstation Blue Screen on Windows 11. So I have currently installed VMware Workstation Pro version 15.5. When I run the already installed VM, it gets a blue screen. If I create new virtual machine here and run it, I get a blue screen. So I decided to make a video of this. I already have a screenshot of the blue screen because directly system goes to uh, reboot. I couldn't make a video of it. So I made a photo. So here you see the blue screen when I boot my virtual machine on Windows 11. Uh, it could be any, any, any Windows, Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10, at the top of Windows 11 within VMware Workstation 15.5. So I get this error. So I rebooted system and logged in in save mode to troubleshoot to see if my antivirus is blocking it or it's, it's conflicting with some programs. So I, I noticed that VMware Workstation was unable to, to open kernel device global vmx86 so that's the driver so i decided let's check the solution for this so here today i'm here with four solution today to solve this problem the first one first check if you have a driver of vmx86 in a salt of course if it is not running it is not working so how you check it so open command prompt cmd as an administrator navigate to a directory where the driver is installed start this command net start vmx86 if successfully run then run vmware it should work but if you get an error or it says that driver is not installed then go to the next solution the next solution is you need to reinstall the vmx86 by removing reinstall it again how do you remove again navigate to the same directory run cmd as an administrator run this command vnetlab dash dash uninstall vmx86 this command will remove the driver reboot the pc and install the driver again in the same path run this command vnet lib dash dash and install vmx86 reboot the pc as well uh, resolve the problem so if this this solution doesn't work you need to check whether the other services of the vmware workstation is disabled so to do that you need to come to start menu or directly on search type services this one search for vmware VMware authorization service. If this service is off and not running, then you get also the same error. Make sure all the services here from VMware is running. If this is stopped, run it. The problem should be solved. But if a cell you have drivers installed, you, re you reconfigured, removed, and reinstalled the drivers. You also check all the services, none of the above worked for you. Then you need to upgrade your VMware workstation. So step four, let's check it. I have VMware workstation pro. Let's check version 15.5. How you can upgrade it? Check for update. Check for update. I get here a message that I need to buy a new version, version 16 Pro. I don't want to do it because I already have a license for uh, VMware Workstation 15.5. But I can freely upgrade to any version before 16 Pro. 
so that means I can upgrade to 15.5.7 if there is an update for it. So how you get that one? Cancel this. Now we get another message. Firmware Workstation Pro version 15.5.7 and this is a free upgrade which recommended for me. Let's download and install it. Depends on your internet speed and speed of your computer. It will be downloaded and installed. Click next. Okay, we need to close this program. Close. Okay, next. Accept the license agreement. Next. I want to insert this driver. I don't want to join the firmware customer experience improvement program. Add shortcut, that's fine. And create. So, I can remove the shortcut from this one. And when this is done, it will put another new shortcut. Yeah, it's already here. It's done. I'll click on finish. I still have a license from uh, Workstation 15.5. So, I'll click finish and enter my license again to reactivate uh, the workstation. Ask for reboot. I will say no. So I will run the VMware workstation now. I want to check the version number. Now I have 15.5.7. So this is the newest version. Let's run the virtual machine. It is running and I don't see any, any blue screen so far. So it worked. Thank you for watching.